Jack Mustang, the most different than any other channel's channel. Proud supporter of Autism Speaks. Well, hello YouTube universe. How's everybody doing today? I'd like to actually start off with some sad news that happened this week. You probably remember Molly, my cousin Maggie's cat, right? I actually filmed her back in December of 2019. Unfortunately, she passed away this past week. She was 20 years old. I gotta admit, that's a long time for a cat. I guess it's true what they say about cats. Cats live longer than dogs. At least Molly wasn't a Siamese cat. <laughs> <laughs> and I even also made this funny meme about her. Check it out. Now, I only now have a 10 minute limit now, which uh, my mom requested because my videos are too long. Of course, uh, I got a minute, but I don't think I'll ever get to the tw 10 minute limit because I only have a little bit to report this week. And I'm also sorry for the background noise. There's this uh, guy grinding some new uh, patio in the background. Um, I guess I gotta get a microphone someday because it would be nice to have a microphone and headphones so you won't have to worry about background noise. So a week ago, I actually had to go to a graduation party, aka a graduation catering party where they pretty much buy food and of course you get your own food. It was my friend Kay's party. Um, I went to a drug mart and bought her a car. And of course I wore a mask because now Ohio is now requiring masks. So masks are mandatory in Ohio now. Now it may not stop coronavirus but hopefully it will help slow down a bit in Ohio. So here's the card I got her. It's a really nice car don't you think? As you can see, I wrote on the card. Unfortunately, it's not a Hallmark card, but this will do. As you can see, my friend Kay was actually happy to see me. She says she loves all the photos I take. They had a food truck which made pizza, and I built my own pizza. I made pizza with that's pesto, cheese, tomato, basil, and I think garlic? I can't remember, but please pause and go back to where you can read the information of the pizza. And they had cake, which um, it was really good, um, even though it was just bought from Giant Eagle, but it was good. And of course, all of her friends were there, even Logan, which I never recognized him. I can't even remember who Logan was. It was actually, it's basically now my friend Casey's ex-boyfriend now. And I met his new girlfriend, which had a son named Mason, which he was kind of cute. Very cute baby. The funny thing is, I follow both of them on Facebook. And of course, earlier that day, I went to the pool, which was very hot out, and it was a really nice day to go to the pool. And of course, it was a few times where I went to the shallow end and got sprayed by that igloo or, um, mushroom thing which um, you usually have it turn off due to probably maybe the risk of coronavirus being stuck on the um, mushroom thing. <music> tried opening my eyes underwater but it was so hard to do it because I was afraid the chlorine was going to get in my eyes and hurt me or hurt my eyes. Now then, schools. I was wondering and the most question of all of people asking, should schools reopen this year? Uh, my answer would be no, but unfortunately my school, my local school that I went to actually is going to be open, which in fact, uh, high school is doing the best because they're not allowing anyone in school. But the stupid thing is, middle school is allowing people to go to school. How crazy is that? As for homecoming, winter formals, and prom dances, I don't believe there will be one. But hopefully they will have prom in 2021. As for me, and maybe also Catherine, I think the CVAC dinner dance is a 50-50 chance this year. 
As for Catherine, I think about her a lot. Of course, she's a very beautiful thing I ever seen. As for the ridge, I've been dreaming about it to go again. I also love both of her cats as well, Frankfurt and Alley Cat. Now we do have a ring doorbell, which um, I am not really that big fan of like doorbells with hidden cameras because although I actually heard rumors of people hacking in them to them and like talking through them, I am afraid that might happen, but you never know what could happen. So that's why the reason why I like the traditional old doorbell that just chimes. As for me, I basically send snaps with uh, me and Catherine's bit emojis on there to see if she can actually uh, snap me back. But sometimes she does, sometimes she doesn't. As for July, it gets real hot out there, both day and night. And I always keep seeing advertisements for cars both on Instagram and Facebook. I always wish I can get a car these days. And I also want to get a car that has low emissions and doesn't pollute that much air, meaning the fact that it's eco-friendly. Car makers like Toyotas and Hondas. What I really want is that 2021 Mustang Mach-E by Ford. The kind of car that I used for my YouTube channel logo. Anyway guys, I think that wraps it up for today. Of course, here's a spy cam picture from a spy cam that I have. We got really exciting event along the way. We are going to Gatlinburg, Tennessee in two weeks. We are staying in a very beautiful cabin. Basically a cabin on top of the Smoky Mountains. It's got a really awesome living room, kitchen, movie theater room, hot tub slash jacuzzi, a game room, and a very nice view of the mountains. Oh, and it also has a pool table, which I really hope my dad teaches me how to play. Anyway guys, thanks for watching, and Shark Week is on the way. Country road.